1,600 fatal overdoses occurred in the U.S. between November 2020 and November of 2021, averaging 293 deaths a day. A report released today by Project Opioid shows fentanyl is to blame for many of these deaths. KSBY News reporter Delaney White has details about the new initiative in Santa Barbara County aimed at decreasing these numbers. Community leaders gathered here at the Santa Ynez Marriott on Wednesday to announce the launch of Project Opioid. And those involved with the project tell me it's centered around educating the public and bringing together community leaders to combat the opioid crisis. Project Opioid is the latest effort to tackle the opioid crisis in Santa Barbara County. The goal is to bring community leaders from different specialties together to tackle the problem and develop solutions. Wednesday's event in Santa Ynez featured the release of a report that outlines the threat opioids pose in California. People start to use drugs because of um, some issue or problem that they're having and drugs can be very effective for solving that problem or issue. Opiates are a popular solution for those suffering from chronic pain and how one psychologist says many individuals begin using. What happens over time is that people develop um, withdrawal and tolerance to that drug itself and then it becomes problematic. The involvement of leaders from across the county is what sets Project Opioid apart from previous efforts. There are things that community leaders in churches can do that public safety can and both skill sets are needed to address the problem. Law enforcement says this project is vital to the safety of the community. We're losing brothers and sisters and, and children. Community leaders are hoping to educate the public and prevent fatalities. And uh, the people that are that are dying from this uh, oftentimes are through poisoning, so they don't even know that they're taking fentanyl. Resources and education will also be more readily available countywide. Our community will benefit not only from learning all of the different treatments and services available, but also in providing that support for those experiencing addiction. It's important for us to continue doing this work where we set stigma aside, we set our judgments aside, and we move forward with everything we have to ensure that one more life does not need to be lost to a preventable death. Another key finding in that report shows that of 133 overdose deaths in Santa Barbara County between January 2020 and January 2021, seven and a half percent were solely from fentanyl. Reporting in Santa Inez, Delaney Wyatt, KSBY News. A link to the full report released during today's press conference can be found on our website, ksby.com.